everyone welcome back to my channel my name is melody and i make faith-based content here on youtube and this is my first mom vlog so i'm very excited i am the mother to an eight week old baby girl and she's currently upstairs sleeping with my husband we had a rough night I will tell you more about that later, but right now I have like 10 minutes to come downstairs. She's due for a feeding, so I wanted to sneak away, come downstairs. I got a little bit ready for the day, um, but I want to make my morning drink, get some water, and then we got to go back upstairs and feed the little shorty. So let's make this morning drink. What I've been drinking every morning for the past month or so is eight ounces of athletic greens and i'm going to be telling you guys all about them as i make my drink this morning but basically athletic greens it helps you get in your vitamins and your nutrients and for me it's been super helpful one as a busy mom who has like 10 minutes in the morning to get something in but two as i'm getting back into fitness after having my daughter so full transparency i gained 50 pounds while i was pregnant and it is not melting off the way that i thought so having this drink every morning while it's not like supporting weight loss or anything it just helps me know that i'm getting in all the nutrients and it's helping me not necessarily focus on the number of weight loss or anything like that, but just making sure that I'm taking care of my body. And I know as I'm taking care of my body with not just this, but walking and starting to slowly work out and just being mindful of what I eat, that the weight will eventually, I hope, <laughs> fall off. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna make this drink and tell you guys more about Athletic Greens. And thank you to them for sponsoring this video. So. Let's get into it. Athletic Greens is basically this nutrition company that's created an entire movement around simplifying your health routine. They've created this powder, the AG1, which you see me using here. And in the powder, it contains over 75 different vitamins and minerals, prebiotics, antioxidants, superfoods, and digestive enzymes. All of this together really helps support your gut health, your immunity, energy, recovery, focus, and aging. What I personally love most about this is just how easy it is to incorporate into my busy routine. All I have to do is get a cup of water, dump the powder in it, shake, 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 and bam, I'm good to go. And I know that I'm supplying my body with things that are good for it. And in this season of my life, there's really nothing more important. And another great thing about Athletic Greens is that their products are completely gluten-free. There are no eggs, no added sugar, which is huge. It's also nut-free and dairy-free. Alrighties, we have the goodness. Cheers, guys. So I personally love to start my morning and drink this on an empty stomach. I feel like it just helps all the vitamins and the nutrients just really sink into my system. So thank you again to Athletic Greens for sponsoring this video. And if you guys want to check them out for yourselves, which I definitely encourage you to, you can use the link in my description box and that will get you their immunity bundle. So the bundle comes with a one year supply of their vitamin D as well as five free packets of the Athletic Green powder. So definitely check it out if you guys are interested. And again, that link is going to be in the description box. So let me go ahead and uh, finish this and we are gonna go upstairs and feed a cute little hungry baby. All righty, let's get some water and let's get upstairs. Oh no. Babe? 
I think I left my phone downstairs. So it's officially time for me to eat breakfast. I haven't even eaten breakfast yet. It has just been one of those days. So let's eat some breakfast. I'm going to make my new fave. I don't know if I should look at myself or do I look at the camera? I probably should look at the camera. Yeah, I probably should look here. Um, also, we just got this mirror and I have to hang up the gallery wall. This is like planning for it. But we got this mirror from West Elm and, and I really like it. And we finally got curtains or blinds or whatever for this and for this window. Um, but anywho, yeah. It's just been one of those days, one of those mornings. When the morning starts off rough, I feel like the rest of the day just kind of like unfolds crazily. So that's really what we're working with right now. But let's make some breakfast. <laughs> We love it. We feel very like put together. Breakfast was phenomenal. Every time I eat it, I'm like, oh my God, heaven. Bliss. Um, I actually need to take my vitamins. Right now, I'm taking D3 for some immunity. I have my ritual per use. You guys know I love virtual. And then I have my um, breastfeeding vitamin. This one is liquid gold mm. okay we've taken our vitamins let's go upstairs I feel like we can get some stuff done in my office while we have some time you know what I mean I feel like this is my mom life, like finding pockets of time to do stuff in, because I feed her during the day every three hours, but my feeds, like our nursing sessions, take about 45 minutes to an hour. So every three hours, I'm busy for one hour. And that's if she goes down afterwards. Usually what ends up happening is I'll feed her and then I'll pass her to my husband and he will put her down. And that's why I'm so nervous about, oops, about him leaving. Because that means it's just all me. And I feel like what's gonna end up happening is I'm gonna feed her I'm gonna blink and it's gonna be time to feed her again. And now she's crying. Okay, let's go get the little boo. Oh yeah, and let me tell you guys about this title, okay? X is leaving us. Okay, first let me go get the girl and then I'll tell you guys. Okay, boo boo. I think she just wants to snuggle today. But yeah, okay, let's talk about this title, guys. My husband is leaving us. It's not clickbait, he's really leaving us tomorrow. And if I'm being completely honest, I am nervous. 
I don't know if any new moms can relate, um, but we both have had off work. Like I get almost six months off of my job, like my corporate job. My husband gets four months off of his job and every day it's us tag teaming it. I feed, I pass them, pass her to him to put down. And he just has this way of, he has the magic touch, honestly. I got the boobies, I got the milk, but he has the magic touch getting her to calm down, go to bed, relax, stop crying. So I'm nervous. He is leaving tomorrow to go to one of his good friend's bachelor parties here in, a, in a, not Atlanta, but here in Georgia. And I'm really excited for him. Like genuinely, I'm excited for him to get out, to go, to have a night away. And we've known about this before she was even here. So it's like, it's not last minute. I've mentally prepared myself for this. But now that she's here and like it's happening, like he's leaving tomorrow, I am, I'm really nervous. I'm really, really nervous. I know that we'll be fine. I know that I will keep her alive. I know that we will survive. But will we thrive though? I really, I don't know. What my biggest fear is, is just her crying and me not being able to console her without just feeding her again. And I don't wanna overfeed her because she has gas issues. And so that's really not good for her. But sometimes it's like the only thing that calms her down if my husband isn't here. So <sighs> you guys pray for us. This also just makes me like appreciate partnership. I honestly couldn't imagine doing, having a newborn by myself, like my heart, and my respect goes out to single parents. This is no small feat, guys. Keeping a newborn alive, but not just keeping them alive, but like keeping them happy. You know, trying to keep them happy. This thing is hard. So yeah, this is like real life right here. We got plans. Sometimes the plans go out the window because little boo needs you. So the only other stuff on the agenda that I really wanna get done today is go for a walk, number one. Number two, I have a meeting with my assistant at four. We have mm, some stuff to go over. Mm, but hopefully it works out for me to have that meeting and Lil Boo is okay with it. Mm, yeah, you give mama a smile. Wanna sit? You tell mama what happened? What happened? Yeah. She found her. Oh, ooh, yeah. <laughs> she found her voice recently. It is so sweet. Yeah. You can show them how you found your voice. You say hi. So sweet. Oh my gosh, did she go through? Ugh. Guys, I don't know what's going on with these diapers. This is the second time today she's peed through a diaper. It used to just be poop. We used to just get poop explosions. We might have to look for a different brand. We've been using Pampers. It might not be it. This is the second time today. This happened when I fed her at three in the morning and it woke her back up. And that's why it took me like two hours to put her back down. Anywho, let me go change her. We'll be back. Alrighties, she's changed, and it actually wasn't a pee explosion. It was a good old poop explosion. So we changed the fit. She's happier. And we got her. Oh, ignore my messy office, guys. We got the girl in the mom room. Now, the real question is will she stay? shall see okay boo boo mama coming mama coming
Success. She is down for the count. And X just got home from his haircut. <coughs> Whenever she's sleeping, I have a tendency to whisper. Are you back? Look at you. Can I show the vlog your haircut? Sure. Want to say hi? Hi. <laughs> Look at that cute dad. <laughs> I like it. Thank you. You're welcome. How are you? Good. Mm. She just went down. Oh, wow. Praise the Lord. Mm. We thank him. Mm. She was crying and I called my mom uh -huh. and I told her how you were leaving uh -huh. and how I'm nervous. She's like, you've got this. You have to be confident. She'll feel your confidence. <laughs> so then once she started crying again, I said, mama's got it. Mama's got it. And then I fed her and she went to sleep. So <laughs> I just have to believe in myself more, I guess. I was like, mom, do you really think she feels my nervousness? She's like, yes. And I was like, oh. Well, I don't know what to do with the rest of this vlog. <laughs> I canceled the meeting I had with my assistant because I wasn't sure if Zoe was gonna go down. I wasn't sure when X is gonna get back from his um, barbershop appointment. And it's, yeah, it's 3.45 now. So I probably will spend the day getting some admin work done. And then I will go on a walk later. You guys have to let me know if you would be interested in me bringing you guys along on my postpartum fitness journey because like i said in the beginning of the video i gained 50 pounds okay and it's not melting off it's gonna be it's gonna be it's gonna take work me both being physically active and watching what i eat and that's probably gonna be the hardest part for me um but it's for that that i'm trying to think of it more as like a lifestyle change you know health overall so anywho this is my lunch. This is Indian curry that um, our friend Adi made for us, which is so sweet. And this amazing kale, apple, and carrot salad. I'm gonna put her Instagram handle up here. She just started a cooking Instagram because she loves cooking. And she makes like simple, quick, healthy meals. And yeah, honestly. What is that, okay? People who cook for new parents are such godsends because it's a struggle. Alrighty guys, I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and wrap up the vlog here. Since Zoe is sleeping and I have like two hours and X is back, I am gonna take advantage of this free time and go for my daily walk. This is something that I'm trying to do, not just for like health reasons, but also my mental health. Probably gonna come back, fold some laundry. <laughs> try to be a little bit productive um anyways mom brain but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this first mom vlog if you did be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you're excited for more or wanting more mom vlogs definitely let me know in the comments below and also in the comments below i would love to know new moms how did you feel the first day that you took care of your baby all by yourself if you have any advice for me please let me know. Um, as you guys heard, I talked to my mom and she was just saying, confidence, be confident. So I'm just gonna try to be confident, try to be positive. And um, yeah, I'll let you guys know on Instagram how everything goes. It's tomorrow, so fingers crossed. Everything goes smoothly. Um, but yeah, again, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today and I will see you in my next video. Peace. Thank you.